if you sell your own branded products on Amazon, you probably want to go ahead and get brand registered. But what is that? What does it mean? And how do we actually become brand registered? Hello and welcome to The Income Highway. This is the show where we talk all about how to build and grow your online business. My name is Paul James Carey and as you can see today is a brown hoodie day so we're talking about Amazon. Brand registry on Amazon is actually quite a simple process and it can really help in terms of building your brand. Now there's a couple of reasons why you might want to go ahead and fill out the online application for brand registry with Amazon so let me talk about them now. First of all, it gives you greater control over your listing for your product. This means that you control the likes of the title, the images, the bullets, the description, you control that. Now you might already be thinking, but don't I already control that if it's my own listing and my own brand? Not necessarily. If somebody else was selling the exact same item as you, and perhaps they even got some of your branded products that they could have bought in bulk somewhere else, well if they were to go ahead and then sell them on Amazon, they actually have the ability to change the listing, so just the title, the images, the description, and so on. However, when you are brand registered, you control the listing. Because of this, it stops what's known as hijacking. Now, a hijacking can occur when somebody who's selling counterfeit products that they're claiming to be yours, they could go ahead and sell them on your listing. That means customers who think they're buying your product could be buying counterfeit products and the person who's putting up the counterfeit product can again also change different elements of the listing such as the title description and images but again when you are brand registered you have more control over that sort of situation another benefit to this is that you actually don't need to go ahead and provide amazon upc codes for every product that you add there on when you're expanding your range now i actually don't do that myself i still prefer to use upc codes when uploading new products to amazon however with brand registry if you don't want to go ahead and get new upcs for all your new products that you're going to bring out in the future you don't have to anymore and also it's free to send in this application for brand registry with amazon so let's go ahead and talk about the application now in terms of how do you actually fill out this application and what's needed to become brand registered it's actually an extremely simple process and amazon only needs some very simple details from you first of all they'll need some contact information such as a phone number and also an email address they'll also want to know a bit about your company so you'll have to provide a company description you'll be asked to then upload two images the first one's going to be your product itself with your brand logo or your name on it and the second one will be your product packaging and that will also need to have either your brand name or your logo on it and the last thing you'll need is a website but don't worry it doesn't have to be a big flashy website that you spent hours and hours and hours on it can be something extremely simple you only want to see a home page and about us something with your product and also something that has your contact information now if you're brand new to making a website i always recommend going to fiverr.com and just have somebody create something very simple on a wordpress website that amazon will actually then go ahead and accept to get this application for if you go ahead and search brand registry when you're in seller central on amazon you should be able to find it easily enough however i will leave a link for it in the description also and as i mentioned at the start of the video going ahead and actually submitting your brand registry application is 100 worth it because it goes ahead and protects your brand and it helps you to go ahead further and build and grow your online business thanks so much for watching this video if you want to learn more about how to build and grow your online business make sure you click the subscribe button below because there's a new video on this channel every monday wednesday and friday it's also in a podcast over on itunes every tuesday and thursday thanks again for watching this video i look forward to talking to you in the future have a fantastic day